We're under starter's orders and we're away here at Alton Park and immediately, immediately, Collard takes the lead. Matt Neal tucks into second place. Third is Andy Jordan. Fourth then is Tom Onslow Cole. Tom Onslow Cole has managed to drag race past Andrew Jordan down the back section into his lot. Rob Collard, he's such a wily racer, but there's a gap. Oh, it's like last year all over again, isn't it? But now Matt Neal makes it stick and Collard loses all of the momentum. Defensive line once more from Rob Collard. And again, he gets another notch and a bit of oversteer. We have it on to Cole, out of a top six position. The fourth position man has gone off and he's going to struggle to get off that soaking wet grass. We're racing again here at Alton Park. Matt Neal crosses the line. Andrew Jordan goes with him. Nice and clean and tidy on the brakes. Matt Neal is going to accelerate out of the final corner at Lodge here at Alton Park and he takes victory. His second victory of the 2012 season. the front it's Matt Neal from Andrew Jordan watch the BMW Collard is he gonna be making one of his trademark starts well he's been boxed he's been really boxed is he gonna go around the outside he gets away with it it's Matt Neal look under the pressure from Jack Matt Jackson gets great momentum wonderful drive and he's round him Gordon Shedden who takes fourth position away from Andy Jordan Jordan will be kicking himself. A bit of a bang. You can see that one coming. He edges him wide. Gets to the inside. He's going to get drive. Watch Collard no, moving no. across. The pair of them go off. They nearly go off and they've lost first and second place and they go to third and fourth. Matt Jackson has got a puncture. Jason Plato has gone through to fourth position. What a fiery drive from Jason Plato. Plato has just about got a half wheel ahead of him. He breaks the timing beam technically in third position. He's 11 seconds back at the leaders, but Plato fires his way through to third position. Gordon Shedden, it's his fifth victory of the 2012 British Touring Car Championship way ahead of everybody else in the field. We are away here at Alton Park now. Great start from Rob Collard in the middle of the field. My goodness me, what a rocket ship start from his sister BMWs at the front of the field as Onslow Cole leads. Oh, and there's drama and there's action and round they go. And is that that's uh, Neat. Andy Neat who's gone round. Jeff Smith comes through. There is Adam Morgan in there as well. And oh, Griffin's, Griffin's gone. gone off now. Oh. And there's another one. And there's another big hit. He's going to go into the gravel at Lodge Corner. Jordan, oh. side by side, contact. No. no, he's into the wall. Look Neil goes Neil through. Was. Neil goes through, side by side. And Neil makes a great line through Island Bend, and he leads. Matt Neil's victorious twice here at Alton Park, ahead of Jason Plato. There we go, the champagne. The champagne jar. So Matt, we're sitting here on the on the top step of the uh, of the podium here at Alton Park. You've seen a fair amount of that this weekend, haven't you? Yes, but totally unexpected, you know, with the equalized, boost equalization formula that they're running this year, and we got a bit of a caning before Alton. Um, we all thought we were staring down the wrong end of a gun this weekend, but to come away with the results we have has just been amazing. Well, we're off to, to Croft in a couple of weeks' time, and that's another circuit where, you know, look back to last year, you had two victories there as well. So how do you, how do you see things shaping up for you this year? Well, Croft is very similar to Alton. It's a technical circuit which needs a really good chassis, which is... You know, the Civic at Alton, it was just sublime to drive around. And it's just, which showed at Thruxton in the wet, now Alton through the technical section. So um, I'm actually looking forward to it. Who do you think is going to be your, your, your chief competitors there? Who are the people that you're worried about? Who do you think? <laughs> Would it be Mr. Plato? It's going to be Jason, isn't it? He's always going to be in the mix. He's now lost a bit of weight. Um, he'll probably keep a bit of boost on us uh, because we've had such a good weekend this weekend. So he's going to be right at the sharp end, I'm, I'm sure. It's a, it's a home circuit for him in many ways as well, obviously, because he spent a lot of time growing up in the northeast as well. So he's going to have the crowd behind him. But it's a good crowd at, at Croft, isn't it? Fabulous. Yeah, they're one of the, the northeastern lot. They're absolutely great fun. And it's, it's a circuit where you can get really close to the action. It's probably the closest of anyone, uh, Croft and Knock Hill. So they can literally feel the pieces of rubber coming off our tires and the, the wind coming past them, especially through turns one, two and three.